COVID is a pandemic that has affected us entirely as a nation. Young people are important in this country, so they need to show it. What is that small thing that you can do to impact? Innovation is the medicine to any challenge. Anytime you see a challenge, just know it's an opportunity to be able to come up with a solution that is able to bring change and make someone smile somewhere. My name is Mo Brian. I'm the lead developer of the Ajiri application, which also developed the zero contact distribution that now we are using to do food distribution in the counties. Food distribution in the past was associated with large gatherings and people have to interact and come closer. So due to the COVID-19 pandemic, our government gave some guidelines that we should stay away from having public gatherings. So we had to come up with a system that will deter people from gathering and also accountability again was an issue during food distribution. Just keeping a track of how many beneficiaries have been reached out, where do they come from, what are their age, what are their age group. It's very evident that uh, we have quite a number of families that are going through economic hardships due to the COVID-19. Uh, so one of the things we wanted to do at least is to cushion some of the families with food hamper that could take them at least for about two weeks. And uh, one of the biggest problems that we faced was how do we go about distributing the food while still maintaining the guidelines of uh, social distancing. And that's why we thought we could partner with Ajiri and uh, Centum Foundation uh, because they had done it before and we knew that they had a system that does zero contact distribution. So that's how the partnership came about. N -N. N -N. N -N the zero contact distribution application gives the people who are willing to do the food distribution the ability to be able to come up with digital vouchers which are generated again by the zero contact distribution application. Then once we generate those vouchers, we also get a list of how many beneficiaries are we willing to target. For example, if we are targeting a thousand beneficiaries, we'll only award a thousand vouchers, which then we send them as a text message. So once we send the message to them, they show up and then we use the youth to do the verification of the voucher. So once the beneficiary comes in with the voucher, we feed in the last six digits of the voucher to the system just to cross-check whether it's a valid voucher. So a one-time secret code is sent to their phone number. And once we cross-check just to verify this is the beneficiary, then we can hand over the food parcels to them. Naomi <laughs> Wabu, you are the car. Mwakenyu a johi a gekuwa, leo gea kiroa ala a gekuwa. Ewe geti kwa demote, demote. Doga mete yo, ewe zegi yo. Nego tohege doge ya kulea. Alea marehe te maradimo, alea maratoro la maragiro. Tuina gekeno, tono neto neto la shuguri kiro adwale ya ahudu. As National Youth Council, we want to loud, applaud actually the young people who sat and developed the zero contact application. That is one of the major innovations that have been developed during this pandemic. And we believe that given the challenges we are facing, young people have a solution. This is the time we are facing uh, unemployment, the highest rates of unemployment. As a youth born in this generation, ours is to make sure that we rise above that as young people and create opportunities for other young people. And that is the only way collectively we can harness our potential, our innovation, our creativity to make sure that we have a better society. The challenges are there, the obstacles are there, but an idea that you create is your idea. How you maximize your opportunity and your space on the digital platform is what will make you unique. We've made quite a couple of uh, partnerships, especially with youth-driven organization and also girl-child supporting organization because again, a society is built up by a family and a family is built up by a father and a mother. So if we have only fathers in the nation and we don't have mothers, then we'll not be able to build up a, a family and 
ends, will not be able to build up a society, will not be able to build up a community, and also will not uh, be able to build up a nation. And also without a nation, you cannot build up a continent. And without the continent, again, you cannot be able to build up the whole world. Before, we were fighting to be included at the decision-making table. Now we are at the table. So now we are fighting more of, let our, our ideas, our inputs, influence the decisions. Because it's one thing to be at the table, it's another thing for your inputs to be taken up. We are working to create a community whereby you are not limited by your age, you are not limited by your gender to be able to do a job. Because with Now Ajiri again, all you need to do is upload your skill set on the platform and any employer from anywhere, as long as you match their qualification, they are able to hire you without the limitation of which county are you coming from, what is your race, they only check the skills. Now that I'm a youth, success to me is touching my fellow youth's life. How can I be part of a solution in your problem? How can we work together and also again come up with a solution that is able to reach out our community and also send out a message to the entire world that once we're working together and we trust and embrace each other, we can be able to become a better generation.